Welcome back, everybody. K Rugby TV. We carry on talking about what's happening in the world of Western Women's Club Rugby. In a second or so, we'll cross to Eitner Tritter, a chairperson of Goodwood Rugby Club. He's going to tell us a little bit about uh, building the structures for 2021 and reaching out to some of the past players. Folks, as you know, M Camp 24, our pharmacy is on the corner of Durban Road and the N1. Um, they're open 24-7. They've got a great coffee shop upstairs. I love the fact that there's free parking at M Camp. And, of course, uh, when you go to M Camp, you can walk around anywhere in the store and somebody will be there to help you at any time. You certainly can't turn around and somebody from MCAM is there to help you. And so what we've decided to take a look at is some of the customer reviews that has come in about MCAM 24-hour pharmacy. And our first review today is from Werner Duplessis. And uh, he's given M MCAM a five-star rating. And he says, this is by far my favorite pharmacy. I don't mind driving a while to get there. It's all worth it. The amount of time that we've had to visit in the middle of the night and once, not once did they drop the ball. The only downside I have is there is only one. I wish there was far more so more people could experience them. Well done guys. Well done for going out of your way for everyone. Fantastic review there from Werner Duplessis about MCAM 24 hour pharmacy. Folks on the line with me now, Eitner Trutter, uh, chairperson of Goodwood Rugby Club. Um, Eitner, nice to have you on the line. Thanks JP, what an honor. Yeah, it's nice to be here. It's nice to chat to you. And uh, looking forward to this conversation. All good, all excited for the years to come. And uh, great stuff uh, lying ahead for us. Yeah, it's the first time for us to get you on the line. Um, nice to see that you're in, 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 in good spirits and that you're healthy. Um, but you've, you've just taken uh, the position as the chairperson of Goodwood Rugby Football Club. That's correct. Um, as, you, as you rightly said, you know, we've got, a, we've got quite a solid old boys fraternity um, in Goodwood, and um, you know we've we've been approached by the previous elected committee to see if we can assist in in uh, turning the club around. We've had a we had a bit of a struggle over the past couple of years, and um, and yeah, so the the previously elected committee uh, approached us and asked us if we would we would be interested in in forming the new committee for the for the for the next couple of years. We accepted the challenge, and um, yeah, planning planning has started. That's exciting. I mean, it's if I look at the, the conversations I've had with with many of the clubs over the last few weeks, uh, especially tapping into, as I said in the in the introduction there, the old boy structure. I mean, this must be very exciting for you guys. It's like you've got so many different dynamics to look at. Yeah, you know, another thing, a huge positive for us is you know we've. We've got a huge amount of experience with within the old boys fraternity of of Goodwood Rugby, and you know we want to try and implement that experience into into the club um, format, and um, I, I think that all the all the players will benefit from that. I think the coaching structure will benefit from it. Um, so yeah, that's that's a huge advantage for us. And you've also got uh, you've got some fantastic facilities to work with there. You've got a. Uh, great clubhouse. You've got the entertainment hall on the side. You've got a stand that is conducive to to the fans. A parking lot. I mean, you've got a lot of tools to work with. Yeah, we we are really blessed. We are really blessed with the facilities. There's a there's a lot of um, work to be done on it. It went a bit backwards over the past couple of years. Um, so yeah, there's there's still a lot of work to be done. A lot of upgrading that we need to do. But the, but the bases are there. You know, the structure are there, and we just need to need to tidy it up a bit. And uh, yeah, we're really blessed with the facilities that we've got. It's, it's probably one of the best in the Western Cape. And from a from a from a general structure point of view, I mean, I know, of course, uh, you, you know, we've been doing these media marketing sponsorship workshops and talking about supporters club models and and so on. Um, do you feel that you're going to be be, be moving in that direction, uh, players and members um, um, becoming sort of? I mean, you've got such a such a big uh, um, history at Goodwood. Yeah, no, we'll definitely move into the in, in that direction. I think there's a couple of a couple of our um, management team that's actually um, comp well taking part in your marketing sponsorship uh, workshops. So we hopefully we can we can take that um, advice and and methods taking it forward and implement it in our in our club structure. I think uh, there's there's definitely a use for it there, and um, yeah. That's what we're trying to implement and, and see what we can get out of it. So are the guys, the players uh, still talking to each other with white, what, on WhatsApp and sending each other funny videos and pictures? 
Yeah, no, we've definitely been in touch. Um, definitely the WhatsApp groups have been buzzing. Um, the Oaks are keen to get back on the field. Um, so, yeah, they, they, they're really, really keen to get going. So hopefully we will get some positive news in the months to come. Um, we've been engaging with Western Province Rugby Union as well. It doesn't look that great for 2020, but definitely the start of, 29, of 2021. Uh, we need to get between the four white lines, yeah, for sure. We have to see what happens there, yeah. I suppose, I think you guys will also be targeting local business in, in the area to, to support the club. Yes, um, we we desperate need of some financial assistance. Um, so we've, we've engaged with a couple of, of local companies or, um, within the community. We've also arranged for some... Um, you know, sponsorship evenings, golf days, we'll be engaging with some, some people um, and hopefully get a network together that can support us in the next next couple of years. We definitely we definitely need of that job. And so if there are sponsors out there in the Goodwood area, um, local business uh, or past players who are watching this right now and want to sign up and join and say, we put our name on the list, um, how, how, do they, how do they get in touch with you guys? Uh, I'm assuming Facebook's probably the easiest. <laughs> yeah, no, definitely. I've, we've we've learned quite a bit from you. So, you know, our Facebook page is up and running. It's the Goodwood Rugby Football Club. They can also email us on uh, GoodwoodRFC75 at gmail.com. Uh, I know we'll leave it at that. We look forward to following the progress. And as soon as there are player pictures and fun pictures, send them to us, and and uh, we'll we'll happily share the. Share the positive vibes. Awesome, awesome. Yeah, and every, anybody that's out there that wants to join, come and come and have a, a good fun raga session with us. You know, you're more than welcome to to give us a buzz, and we'll we'll get in touch, and uh, we'll link you up with the right people. Yeah, hopefully we can all get back on the field soon. Everybody's desperately missing it. That's what it's the the heart and soul of what it is that we do. Absolutely, absolutely. Thanks, Eitner. Here we go, folks. Aitna Trutta, um, of course, uh, Goodwood Rugby Football Club uh, chairperson. Uh, got some exciting visions uh, for the future. Looking forward to seeing what's going to happen at Goodwood. So many of the clubs planning for next year, building the old boy structures, building the facilities, getting the sponsors in place. Goodwood's one of those clubs. And if you want to get a hold of Goodwood, then as you heard there, um, GoodwoodRFC75 at gmail.com. Get hold of um, get hold of Eitner on, on that email. Get hold of the club. Sign up as a past player. Sign up as a sponsor. Uh, sign up as a player. Um, oh, sign up as a fan. Anyway, folks, that's how you get all the Goodwood, or you can find them on Facebook. That's a wrap from us here. We'll see you after the break. Don't go away.